Okay, let's connect and talk about a former Super Bowl winning quarterback. Yeah, what do they do when they retire? Well, a lot go on to do TV, but one former Tampa Bay Bucks QB is a TikTok star. I want you to take a look at your screen. Brad Johnson's offerings, the former NFL quarterback, is very active on the social media platform, showing off his trick shots. So you can find them on Big Brad 14. He says his first love was basketball and played at Florida State for two years before football became his passion. Now he's on the court showing off his horse skills. But to be skilled at all these sports, wow. Wow. Mm -hmm. Go Brad. That last one was pretty cool. Look at They're that. all really He's amazing. giving Buddha a run for his money. Yeah. You know, Impressive. Wow. Buddha does those behind the... I wonder if he's got better trick shots or editing skills. <laughs> oh, Dan just called him out. Big he, he must practice. Bad <laughs> Brad, number 14. That's pretty cool. Hey, let's talk about what else is trending this morning. So there is a National Toy Hall of Fame, and the 2021 nominations are out. Um, apparently, they receive thousands of nominations every year. Let's take a look at our screen. Um, I want to showcase some of them. We've got the American Girl dolls, um, Battleship. Some of these will kind of bring back fond memories. I'm going to keep going down because there's one on here that I really question, and I want to see what you guys think. I'll bring it down. One of the toys that's in the nominations, just plain old sand. Sand. That's not, a fun toy. Not the sand pail and little shovel? It's just the sand. The sand. I mean... Okay. Well, it's one of my favorite toys, but I wonder how much we can sell it. this for. Yeah. We could make some money. We you know? could. <laughs> I mean, just go get some sand from the beach and sell it. And it's an easy gift to get your kids to yeah. as a toy. Uh -huh. You don't need to buy them those expensive dolls. Just, just go sand. to the beach, get a bucket of sand. You're getting one of the best toys in all the land. Mm. No, I'm just seeing a, a money-making proposition here. You know, all right. just go get some sand and sell it on eBay. Well, and when my kids were itty bitty, they liked the wrapping paper better than you know Christmas. <laughs> Yeah, better than right. the present. So yeah. like, we right. can sell sand and wrapping paper. So you just wrap an empty <laughs> box and they're super pumped. We're making things easy, okay? Mm -hmm. We're giving you some ideas at home. Hey, let's take a look at today's uh, totally random poll. We want to know, um, do you think wisdom really comes with age? Uh, most Utahns say yes, 34% say no. Uh, we have Brandon that wrote in saying, you know, wisdom's linked to more so to age purely because you experience more life. But Jeff has a good point. He says, unless you are a teenager and then you just know everything... <laughs> In yeah, that's depth. true. They just don't realize it yet. Yeah. They think they do. Yeah, well, they're, they're fa they have two favorite words. One is no, and the other is nuh uh. <laughs> I like, I like It's because they know better. Nuh uh. Well, you just got to take it and let them know. You'll be. Oh, they'll figure it out. 